The rates are lower, guys, and it's the only thing anybody can talk about in the mortgage industry this week. But what they're not telling you is what and how does this affect your pocketbook. And this is crucial for my first-time home buyers and my first-time sellers right now. We are in a limited window when the rates soften this much and come down before you start losing buying power because you're still on the sidelines waiting to see how low it can go. So here's what I want to tell you. When rates drop this much, this quick, two things are happening. We have a window where you're going to be able to still have buying power and there's still inventory on the market that's been sitting. So you can get those seller concessions, you can negotiate repairs, you can get in at fair market value, and your payment now allows you to get maybe that bedroom and bathroom you were looking for, closer to daycare, closer to school. It's a $25,000 buying power jump that just happened for you for Q4. And if you wait and it gets lower and people with more credit, with better financials, with more money in the bank come into the market and there's more demand and the prices go up, you lose. So right now, if you're sitting on the sidelines, literally you could be saving money in your monthly payment or bumping up your purchasing price power and getting seller concessions or you wait and someone else is gonna beat you, so you choose.